Yo guys, what's up? What's good? Well, afternoon. It's your boy Daki. Um, wearing, um, my name is Daki. I'm wearing uh, black clothes, black trousers, black pillows, um, black shirt to so many doctors around here. Anyways, I'm spelled D R K I E E E. I was mentioning here is Paul Way. Paul was good. I'm awesome. I don't, I don't, I don't understand why you had to like mention so many dark things. Yeah, like my name Daki. No, dark. no, I mean it's figuratively. You don't say too many dark things. So. So when you say too many dark things, we we'll always try to like explain to people what dark things mean. But anyways, my guys, how far how on a day? Um, I really want to thank you. Leave this guy out of the picture. I know. Right? I really want to thank you guys for everything that you do. Thank you for liking. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for everything that you do. We really, really appreciate you guys. Anyways, quick comes today. I'm sure of way. Um, over yesterday, we know that we talk about um, when this person is going to come outside officially. People have been asking questions. Fans have come out with their saying, "Oga, come outside." His friends, his aides have been saying. Somebody is coming, somebody is coming. Finally, David Doe has come outside. He came out, uh, I thought I was going to react when he came out yesterday. And that's why the person was like, there was a lot of posts everywhere. Post. I was seeing the tweets, everyone was retweeting and everything. How did you feel when you first saw the when you first saw Bro, like I had a goose, like I had a goose feeling. I'm like, yo, where I was, I was like, I screaming like, yo, David is back. Like, David is back, bro. I felt like I was having, a, I was having a mellow, dramatic day, but. Once I saw that post, I was like, oh my goodness, this is such a good feeling and I'm so oh. excited. And I believe that most people felt the same way that I felt. Yeah, almost everybody, almost everybody. And it's quick on that we saw where, um, this actually came out to tell us that, uh, um, we outside, um, uh, Flex My Soul, every banger and everything, 31st of March. Now, um, this, this was the song where they had, um, uh, uh, where he said, Anywhere something day, and I didn't go to be and everything. Um, anywhere during me day, anywhere yeah. during me, I go day and everything. And, um, yeah. People, he has told us the stress of March, right. and um, it looked like he knew what he was saying. You know, just after that, it was looking like maybe it was capping. We saw where he reminded us again. We saw where the, the jet and the um, Rolls Royce, and then said, "Oh, God is coming." So obviously, only Israel at the time knew what was happening. Only knew um, what was up. We saw where I we, we asked that last week. Is there yeah, about week, somebody yeah. actually um, made like a move where he archived or uh, deleted, not even archived, deleted almost about 4,000 plus posts, leaving just three, removing his DP, um, if I chairman is, and then his performance at the World Cup. So people are like, what's up? Are you okay? Is it, is it like the depression, all of that? And we saw where at, at the Beret party he came out. So that was like, okay, he's okay. He's happy. And yeah, yesterday we saw the video come now to tell us, uh, this, this post is, this post is, this post is, this post is amazing. We saw where to say, there's, there's time for everything. <laughs> I love that voice, yeah. But then I said it's time for everything, it's time to grieve, and it's time to heal, it's time to laugh, it's time to dance, it's time to speak, and it's time for silence. Thank you, thank you to everyone out there for your love and support that has held me down. All the love and messages while, while I was away, the gift sent, the concert you all through. I appreciate it all. Today I want to remind you all that what was once time, what is now timeless was once new. It's time for new. My next album, Timeless, is here, March 31st. Please save link. In the bio, two things. Israel said the first of March, and then the album dropped the first of March. How do you feel about that? Start with. Uh, first off, I mean Israel is one of the closest guys to like David. Yeah, and um, Israel is almost uncontrollable. Like, <laughs> yeah. well, you know, like you know, David loves Israel like that. And yeah, true. The love is very mutual, you know. And of course, when Israel came out to say that, I knew that something was going to come up. But of course, we really were not setting. But I know that definitely Obio would have you know, seeing that post to say, oh, okay, my guy is coming, my guy is coming. Maybe out of too much excitement, but I I, I dare say that there's nothing that will come out of the OBO camp or David O camp no, that will not get to OBO. All right. So um so I think he just really allowed the post to like fest up for a bit. And of course, true to what you know um Israel said uh David is coming with it first and and I think the internet shut down yesterday when that announcement was made. Yeah, I said, uh, just after the announcement, aside the fact that the first we saw a lot of stuff on the video, it dropped a snippet of a piano beats right. at the end. And right. then I said, um, well, now believe we, eh, yeah. I'm not sure what we're yeah. going to talk about that. But then, um, let's go back to Israel here. Yeah. yeah. Album 31st. Two quick questions here. Um, we don't know what the album looks like. Yes. Yeah. 
and then um, people are just, are just thought about it. Mm-hmm. Last year, he dropped a single, mm-hmm. uh, which was supposed to be followed by an album, which right. he didn't drop. Mm-hmm. And there's a stand, there's a stand strong sing, single, right? Did that make sense? Well, numbers and everything. And now, usually, say flex my soul. And so, do you think, longer, should you think on this project, there's going to be a stand strong and a flex my soul? Absolutely correct. I think that's going to happen definitely. The stand strong going to be on the project. Definitely. I can, I can assure you that. That's gonna happen, but I mean, if it doesn't happen, then I mean, it was just maybe like a clear and obvious error from my own end. But <laughs> I, 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 I believe, I believe that it's be on the project. I should think it's gonna be on the project, but ah, uh, you know, and, and for me, Obio never really misses. So there's just like like hit and hit songs in the project, yeah. and Flex My Soul is already sounding so super super dope. So that's like a no skip album in my own opinion. That's gonna come and. The anticipation is really, really crazy right now. Ah, really crazy right now. Ah, we saw where you actually dropped videos where it was in the forest, kind of running around and uh, whatever, he, whatever it was that was making me that only is, I think, more like a video prop and everything. Right. Uh, so, so apparently, the video has been outside. Right. Because obviously, because this, this didn't happen yesterday. Right. Yeah, so this, this is where people set it up for shoot in the forest and everything. So, we're sure, you know, I think it's safe to say, um, videos are maybe even available for the, for the album already. Right. So, why wait that first? Um, for me, I feel like, you know, he said it was going to come in March. And yeah, was, not dates. Not. You know, there was no date, yeah. specific date. So it's like, okay, we're almost getting to the end of March. Yeah, true. And then he's saying, oh, okay, March at first would be like the perfect time because Obio says and he does. Obio will never come and give excuses for like the other people who always mm. give excuses, you know. But uh, the truth is, Obio said he's going to come out in March. We were not certain about the date, but 31st, the last day of the month. And boom he's out obviously this project has been cooking for a while and yeah, there's been a lot of back back you know stories to it of course that they tried to make sure that that's not in the media so to you know um, build up speculations and all of that stuff but i feel like videos have already been set trust me yeah, because for some. this this project is gonna like blow people's mind and people are gonna be talking about it for a long, long time, time yeah. um, because of obviously what has happened with David over the time, and then of course you know his um, um, phase of healing through the process of now coming to like feed his fans the best of him right now. Because um, I want to see everything exemplified in that project. His pain, his struggle, the laughter, the joy, literally everything, and that's exactly what people are looking for. So he's been outside, he's been doing a lot of stuff, mm-hmm. and um, you know the snippet, you know, is just the proof that. David has been outside. You know, it's just really time right now. Anyway, this is what the artwork look like for the for the project. Um, um, I, I, you know, for for some places, if you watch all those uh, Indian, uh, nothing more Indian, all those um movies that have like portals where people come for like it's an where it's an indie movies, yeah. Right. So there's, there's only like a portal where they can access through, right. and the portal is really like your wall. So it looks like this kind of a portal thingy where right. the man, one old man with one white long beard <laughs> will now appear from here. Then when he's going back, he will now stand there. Will now. This is the and goes back. So, um, no offense, I have speculations like, okay, what was this portal doing there with those mind? But anyways, when they, when they won't come, uh, you're going to sell up that. But yeah, following this today, um, we've seen how things have unfolded the video from the person of the son to, um, him getting married, um, to trauma as it were, to this phase of him where he's trying to get himself all together and everything. Do you think there's any form of pressure for the video on the album? The video? Pressure? No way. Thing about it is, <laughs> David is, David is just the type of person that's very lovable. Everybody loves David. I don't think there's anybody who genuinely does not love David. I love that word, genuinely. So the, the thing about, the thing about him is, there's no pressure. He's really been good. Like I said, he's really been going through quite a lot. Yeah. He's coming back from a lot. And then he's trying to obviously, you know, get back into the music scene and tell his stories with the songs that he's written and the songs that he's recorded. So I think for me, it's just like a really wholesome project. And everybody's really anticipating this one. And we trust that it's going to be a December. And like I said, again, David is, I mean, a man of his words. He will never tell you that I'm going to come out in March. I know, I'm trying to try to delay. You're true. Like other people. <laughs> I did not mention it. I was going to ask you to mention this. But, but, but truth is, David is David and everybody's super excited for him. And we are really, really looking forward to the project. Anyways, guys, we'll come to the end of this one, but trust me, I won't leave you without asking for your opinion. What do you think about the Vidos Return, this project, this album, this location? Do you think it's already for more pressure? What do you want to see on the project? Or what do you want to say to David Duke? Say it in the comment section. Let us send it on. I think I sent the file. Send the PDF file. Send it to the Vidos team, and obviously, you watch I look at them. I'm so happy you did all of that. Guys, I love you so much. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Stay safe, guys. David is back. David is back.